So this year's project, we're going to do a ski jump because of the Winter Olympics. So what you're going to do, you're going to have a long three foot section like this, and you're going to have this. So the way you assemble the ramp, very simple. You'll see that if you put this down, it will rotate up like that. And then this will just fit right into it. And that's it. And you can see, you can adjust the angle, or this actually slides up and down to adjust how high it is. So the materials we're going to use are uh, various materials here. You'll see it in your data sheet. We've got plates, uh, cups, paper, tape, pipe cleaners, right, that you can bend and shape. And the whole point is to create a ramp, just like a ski jump. So we're going to have marbles here. And with these marbles, we're going to basically put them down here. The kids are going to come up, they're going to put their projects. So we have three projects right here. So let's try these three projects out. So the first project, I used two plates, uh, kind of bent them. The nice thing about plates is, you know, if you take a plate and you just bend it down like this, you get a very simple ramp to use. So what we did, we take, I, I took this uh, cup, we'll have styrofoam cups instead of paper, but same concept. So I just cut a hole in there, so that way it can easily fit right over there. We'll adjust it like that. Maybe we'll try to bring it a little bit higher, just to give it a little bit more uh, potential energy. And now we'll do our test. So we're gonna see, we're gonna have it's usually easy with two volunteers, one person to put the marble in, and if you just watch out, you back up a little bit because you don't want. And we're gonna see where the marble lands. Whoa, that was a long one. So that was awesome. We're gonna put the tape down. And that's going to be our first group. So the next group's going to come up, and they're going to have what they have. So this one, I used the pipe cleaners, so I created sort of a V shape there. I created, I don't know if you can see, but I created a coil there, and that way it'll should fit right over. And for this one, you actually probably want to go a little bit further down, like that, maybe a little bit of an angle. You know, we could play around like this if they want. So. We now have a thing. Hopefully, this will work. And we'll move it close to the edge just so that we get a little bit further. And three, two, one. Oh, not that great. It was a two. It was a two. All right, right here. Okay. So, not as good. So, let's put that one over there. That was and rubbish. Our final project. This one. Uh, which we'll do like this, and this one. It will kill you. Move like that. Do you have a marble? Uh, no. Oh, okay. <laughs> so let's go get a marble. Uh, does anyone know where any of the marbles are? Oh, yeah. All right, great. So last one. Here we go. Marble. Not bad. Right there, right there. Okay. Right there. Perfect. Right, wish, so, wish. Yep. There we go. So clearly, the first group was the best one because they were able to jump the furthest. So, pretty simple project. Um, good luck with it. And, yeah. Uh, yeah yes. As oh, always, Agus shows up for